Welcome back, Kleshka crew, to another episode of Diamond Dynasty. It is time to debut the very first Lightning player for MLB The Show 23. The player who had the best month to start off this season was Matt Chapman. 384 average, 5 home runs, 21 RBIs, earned him this 99 Lightning card. And he will not be the only new cards I'm using today. Sharing the left side of the infield with him, I put Drew Maggie at short. And his story is incredible. 13 years in the minors, makes it up, and is enjoying his time with the Pirates. At least I hope they did not send him back down yet. Right side of the infield, you have Luis Arias. I feel like I might actually start using this on my God Squad. Take me to the Crone Zone. Jake Cronenworth got him at first. Little Tops Now card. Always got to love a switch hitting catcher and that's what we got with jonah heim he might end up being my catcher on my god squad too but it'll be hard to replace kensuke throwing brent rooker at dh great hitting stats the feeling though let's pretend we don't see that jared kelnick is finally shining at the major league level i got him in left field james alman a huge breakout rookie for the dodgers right now i got him in center and i miss him so much and i'm so glad he got a diamond card brandon marsh is going to be in right field this is how I'm going to throw them into the lineup. I also got Jorge Mateo, Jackson Winski, Yandy Diaz, and Thiro Estrada on the bench. Not sure who I want to use at pitcher yet, but these are my options. I'm thinking either Zach Gallen or Mark Pryor. In the bullpen, we got Alex Young, Yenier Cano, and Jose Alvarado. Everybody else is either a Tops Now card or we got Cesa from the Mexico program. And then I still have 97 Otani as my closer. Well, look who else is throwing Zach Gallon. Get things started, man. Is this a custom stadium? I honestly have no idea. And Brandon gonna get underneath a no Whoa! Teleporting powers. How come we don't have that? All right, Chappie, let's bring the thunder. And did we? Oh my God. First pitch I saw with Matt Chapman. Come on! What? I'm not even kidding. That was the very first pitch I saw. I'll show you the pitch count before the pitch and then right there. Amazing. Can we go to the crone zone? Get a ball outside. Ah, oh, it's off the end of the bat and it's unfortunately right at the shortstop. I guess there is a bright spot in Oakland with Brent Rooker, unfortunately. Oh, knocks it down with his body, but he'll stay with it. Oh my Lord, dude. Maybe those stats are a lie, a fluke. We'll find out. Okay, strikeout to start the game for Zach Gallon. Gonna take this all with a grain of salt. Two outs, one pitch to Mike Trout, and that's a pop-up. I'm not gonna get too confident. I have fallen for that trick before, and there we go. We got ourselves a one, two, three. He's going with a lot of outside pitching to start this game. Outside fastball. And now that'll be on the ground for Altman, and he knocks it down. Altman's too fast, and he'll be on. Whoa! I honestly almost went. And Heim, get up the middle. No! Are you serious? And that'll get through for Kellenic, right? Oh, my God. You got to be kidding me. I'm extremely focused right now. And that will be right at Brandon Marsh, thank goodness. He'll swing at junk, but it's got to be in that sweet spot. Like it's, oh goodness, oh, and, yep. You could tell I effed up before I even threw the pitch. You heard me literally go, oh goodness. Oh goodness. I knew I wouldn't feel comfortable with that one run for long. And he'll go down. All right, see if I just throw those perfect change-ups, those good sliders, then we'll be fine. I just got to hit my spots, not mess up too bad, and see if he gets any part of the zone, he's going to hit it. He's not going to miss those is what I'm saying. And Maggie, just left a second. Thank you. Now Maggie leads off. Come on, do something. No. Why is the first baseman the one going for this? Damn, I actually thought it might fall. And of course, I hit it hard, but I hit it right at the shortstop. Is that Chapman? I don't think he has him playing third. And Brandon, right to De La Cruz. Uh. These two got traded for each other, right? Zach Gallen, Jazz Chisholm, and okay, Chapman gonna make his first defensive play. Of course, just like real life Matt, Matt, Matt Chapman. As long as we get these. Oh, Gallen, it's right there. Trey Turner's fast, buddy. Oh my God. And Trout, Trout, Arias, Arias, Arias. Oh, how'd you miss that? Now I got to face Chipper. 
This is not what we wanted. And, oh my god. Wait, he was going to get the base anyways. That was a great pitch. Why, dude? And, oh, come on. Please, 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 please. James Oatman brings it back. Yes. Oh, my God. And, oh, damn it. I mean, either way, I think they were going to get to that ball. And Cronenworth. Oh, my God. Can't get it through the damn hole. You having trouble finding the whole Crone zone? <laughs> Stupid. And a rollover from Brent Rooker that almost hit the bag. This is going to be a tough throw that he easily makes. Really not up for facing his creative player again. Oh, God. And that was why. James Almond's not going to get to this one, unfortunately. Can I stop this creative player? Oh, that's beautiful. Pop up. That is so good for us right now. I might say screw it and take out Gallon early into the game. Man, that's a walk. And that's exactly what I'm doing. Oh my god, and he went the baby route. And no, 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 no. You gotta be kidding me right now. And he sent him. Brandon Marsh coming up with the gun. He's done at home plate. That was the tiniest little meter I had to hit. And yes, got him on the quick pitch. And Outman gets another hit. Okay. And okay, it'll prevent the double play. Honestly, that's good. No, he paints the bottom of the zone. Ah, oh, Maggie makes contact with two outs unless he makes an error, which doesn't happen. And that's Bregman scooping that. Are you serious? Yeah, New York, no. Don't you know? Go for another quick pitch. And okay, stupid ass shift. Late jump by Trey. Strike three on Trout. He's safe. I'm going to hope for a double play. Oh, no. Oh, no. The card said zero ERA. That's not a zero ERA, buddy. And it just keeps going. And I've lost the meter with him, dude. Oh, my God. Yanir Cano. Don't know anything, bro. And I doubt we turn a double play on this. Maybe, actually. Yes, okay. Down by three. And will that find grass for Al Arias? I mean, I almost said Alvarez. Brandon Marsh, get that out the middle. Let's go. Okay, and I'm not going to be stupid. I'm going to leave him at third. Sit low. He wants to throw a slider, right? And that is exactly what I got. Look at me predicting the future. Matt Chapman has 82 speed. No, I can't believe that got in. Oh, he didn't go for the double play. Okay, thank you. Get No, it will bring in a run is the question. Yes, it will. And we're down by one. No, I struck out. Only because it's a righty. I'll let you face Alex Bregman. And that will be a pop-up. Thank goodness. You are done, bro. Your day is over. No more Cano. Going for a bunt. Unbelievable. And we'll nail it. Don't worry. And did you get him? No! I have a bad feeling. I have a great feeling, actually. Never mind. And double play. Jonah Heim, please. Oh, why? I thought the left fielder had this all day. Is he actually going to catch this? No, it's a game-tying home run for Jonah Heim. As soon as I saw the left fielder not moving, I was like, it's gone. But then I saw the center fielder going full sprint like Usain Bolt. And I was like, is it gone? Got ourselves a great game, though, I must say. And that will continue as Jared Kelenic ropes it into the gap. Looking for a big moment from Drew Maggie. We got a full count here. Come on. And fly ball to right. Easily has it. And we are not going to play stupid. We are going to stay at second. And I get hit. Thanks. Don't know if that was intentional to set up a double play or if he did that on accident. I think it's an accident because I think he's taken out. Yep, I knew it. Get up the middle for Brandon Marsh. Please. No, 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 no. Uh, Matt. And get up the middle. Please, please, please. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I'm telling you right now. Damn it. Anybody else gripping their controller to death right here now? Oh, my God. You picked the worst time to miss it, Jonah. I'm you better hope we get a double play to make up for that. And there you go. Luis, take it yourself, Arias. Double play. I don't know what's going to happen, but what an episode. And that'll be Maggie. Oh, dude. Of course, his player is a switch hitter. And he did it to me again. 
And now we get the third out. Of course we do. That's how it always goes. And look at me. Oh, that's going to fall, though. Get down, get down, get down. Run, run, run. Oh, my God. Anybody with decent speed would have probably made that a base hit. And that's not even going to fall for Kellenic, huh? That's just going to get over his head. Get over his head. Damn it. If it wasn't Trey Turner, who is like a cheetah, then we might have had it fall in. And Maggie, damn it. Did I just go down on three pitches just like that? Unbelievable. We did take that L, which sucks, but there were a lot of great moments. James Altman robbing the home run. Brandon Marsh throwing out the run at home plate. Chapman homering on the first pitch he saw. The cherry on top would have been the W. Nobody goes 162-0. Hate his creative player. Four for four. If you made it to the end of this video, let me know, is Matt Chapman here to stay? Because we have him and we have my 99 Chipper Jones. Like the video, subscribe, tell your mom, your dad, your grandma, grandpa, pets, friends, brothers, sister, aunt, uncle, everybody knows, subscribe if they haven't already. I got this, you got this, we all got this, and I will see you next time. <laughs>